Hello everybody, myself Dr. Deepak Arya and today we are talking about a very controversial topic that can milk be given to dogs or not. Well, many people say that uh, milk should not be given to dogs, many people say milk should be given to dogs but there are no logical proofs that we should give milk to dogs or cats or whether we should not give milk to dogs. Well, today we are here to end this controversy up to its final level. Let's go for it and see that can milk be given to dogs or not. So my first point is that uh, what were you feeding your dogs when there was no dog food available in the market or when there was no processed food? Well, the people who are on other side of the screen, you have the answer of that. Most of the people were giving milk with bread or milk with chapati or milk with double bread to your dogs. Well, so how milk can be unhealthy for your pets? Do you have any answer for that? Secondly, we are feeding milk to our dogs from hundreds of years. We are taking milk and we are giving milk to dogs as well. But have you ever seen any dog that his life has decreased? Or have you seen that all the dogs have some allergic reactions or something like that? If you ever seen that, then you can tell me. And other thing is that if you have not feeding your dogs with milk, then have you increased your dog's life? If you think that you have increased your dog's life uh, without giving milk to them, then I am agreed with your point that milk should not be given to dogs. But if you have not done anything like that, so I am sorry brother, many of the vets, many of the shopkeepers, they tell me that milk should not be given to dogs. Well, I want to tell them all that strictly milk is necessary part of diet and milk is the only complete food on earth except vitamin C and iron. So, milk has to be given to dogs. Although there are few controversies as well that will talk about reaction to dogs. Well, I want to tell to each and every person that if allergic reaction has to came, then it has to came within 10 minutes to half an hour time when you give anything to your dog, suppose if you have given X food to your dog or if X injection is given, then allergic reaction has to come within 5 minutes to 15 minutes time. It doesn't mean that the reaction will come in 5 days or after 1 year or 6 months. No, it's not, not like that. So if your dog, you are feeding a dog with milk and if within 15-20 minutes he is not showing any kind of reaction, then it means that milk is 100% safe for your dog. The point is, when milk should not be given to dogs? Let me clear you those points as well. Well, some dogs have motion sickness, just like humans, that if they travel in some public transport or in buses or in trains, then in that case, they have a condition of vomiting. So in that case, those dogs should not be given milk. Well, that uh, you will come to know in one or two, two uh, traveling time only. If you uh, make your dog travel after giving him milk and he pukes out, then it means that he is he has motion sickness. You can try this for one or two times. If you find that, then it means that uh, milk should not be given to dogs. Other is lactose intolerance. Yes, many vets giving long, long lectures on lactose intolerance. I want to tell my those silly brothers that lactose intolerance is in one in thousand people, and for that reason, you are you don't want to give milk to all the pets and all the dogs and cats. Well, in human beings also, one in a hundred or one in a thousand people have lactose intolerance. So that person should not be given milk. Same is the case with dogs. One in a thousand dog has lactose intolerance. And you are suggesting that milk should not be given to all the dogs. Well, this is not true. This is not correct exactly. So I will say only one thing that if you are saying to your pet owners that milk should not be given and instead of that you are giving dog food, then my brother, you are not a dog lover then it means you are a food seller, nothing more than that. Another case in which milk should not be given to dogs is, some medical conditions are also there. For example, if your dog is having cuffing, for example. In cuffing, if you give milk to dogs, then in that case, that uh, dog will develop more cuff. His cuff will increase a lot, then in that case, milk should not be given. Another case, when the, pie, when the problem is regarding the food pie, for example, if a dog is having vomiting or if a dog is having loose motion then in that case if you give milk to him then in that case also milk will aggravate the condition and his vomiting will increase or his uh, loose motions that will increase so i'll suggest you that if your dog, dog is having vomiting loose motion or cuffing 
then in that case don't give milk to your dogs but otherwise milk is a complete best food present on earth that milk is necessary part of diet and you should give milk to your dogs well there is only one suggestion from me my side to you is that in cold countries or in tropical conditions like india in winters you should give warm milk to your dogs when your dog needs some luke warm thing or you can give eggs to your dog but in winter season or uh, you you should give milk and in case of summers you should give buttermilk or curd or dahi or lassi to your dogs because that's have the chilling properties so my suggestion is that in uh, summers give lassi and in uh, winters you should give lukewarm milk to your dog least don't give buffalo milk or milk with lot of fat to your dogs either give cow milk or skimmed milk which has least fat because your dog may not be able to digest it as my fellow members are saying so that's all for today and i hope that your point may be is clear now that milk has to be given to dogs and you should give milk to your dogs